Meditate in a safe place to avoid attack by foes. <laughs> no. In the middle of a battle, just go to your knees. Shouldn't it say safe spaces instead of places? <laughs> I think they misspelled. No. You gotta remember, this is a place that exists that, um, if you deviate from the norm, they kill you. That's not that different than what we actually deal with, is it? <laughs> anyway, I was watching the news this morning, and they've um, come across this story that... Does anyone remember the movie when Harry met Sally? No. Yes. Never seen it. Okay. There is a whole scene in that movie where Same Billy Crystal is explaining... That guys and girls can never be friends because the sex part will always get in the way. Right? That's bullshit. I know it's bullshit, but a guy has, reckons he has scientific proof. Did that guy just. Yeah, um, I saw it. Um... Oh, okay. Scientific proof that it's true. So, unfortunately, Yoda, we can't be friends anymore. Me and Amy are fine because we're brother and sister, but.
Did you get him? Mm -hmm. What happened here? The people of Flotsam let you slay their commandant, but they refused to help our women. They stood and watched as our women burned alive. You could have returned to shore. We jumped overboard, but got there too late. Dandelion ran about, calling for help. He even tried to enter the tower, but he was badly burned, while those human monsters stood and looked on in silence. How's Dandelion? He's below deck. Ran out of the tower in flames and jumped in the river. We fished him out. Sooner or later, humans will kill off all the Enshe. All dwarves and gnomes. Then they'll start murdering one another. Your kind knows no other way. It's in your genes. You'll keep killing each other until only one remains. The strongest among you. A thousand years from now, a dim-witted human barbarian will climb to the top of a pile of bones, sit down and proclaim, I win. Prepare to set sail! Did Vernon Roach sail out of here all right? He's fine, if that's what you ask. We met and chatted. Imagine that. I wanted him to know that he was only leaving because I let him do so. The Temerian Special Forces. 
created by Foltes to combat the Scoyatal after the first war with Nilfgaard. Veterans, professionals, the best of the best. This is the end, Roach. See these emblems? Temerian lilies, that's all I lacked. I've defeated the commanders of all the special forces in the north. Now I shall unite the Scoyatel. Finish what you started. I shan't kill you, Roach. We Enshe never kill the last specimens of dying breeds. Live on and remember who defeated you. Remember he can do so again. Va fail, Vernon Roach. You're making a mistake, Jorveth. I will find you. Unfurl the mainsail! We made it. This is just the beginning. But you chose the right side. I wish I could be so sure. The assassin had had his day. Very true. He'd kidnapped Triss Marigold. It seemed like Fulta's life had not been enough. It seemed like the killer also wanted the monarch's former advisor. There was no time to think. It was time to act. Grabbing Geralt, I embarked on a voyage upriver, deeper into the Pontar Valley. If the elves could be believed, it was there that free folk from all around had assembled beneath Vergen's banners to resist the Kedweni invader. I should mention the exceptional individuals who made up my fellowship for this important quest. I usually get nervous around Scoyatel. I see them as scoundrels and murderers and find their presence outright unwanted. But I must admit I was glad to have the help of Yorveth and his infamous bunch, who could prove highly helpful. Help, helpful? That's not nice. Highly useful then.